Saman Utraki released from EFCC custody. Justice Yusuf Halilu of the Federal High Court in Abuja has granted bail to former governor of Jigawa State, Saman Utraki, who was arrested by the EFCC. As part of his bail conditions, Traki was required to submit his traveling documents to the registry of the court. The former governor was also mandated to produce two reasonable sureties who are residents in Abuja and sign a register to be opened at the EFCC office every two weeks. A former governor of Jigawa State, Saman Udraki, who was arrested by operatives of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, in Abuja on July 4, has been granted bail by a high court in Abuja. The punch reports that Justice used Halilu on Thursday, July 13 granted the former governor bail on conditions which required him to submit his traveling documents to the registry of the court. The former governor was also mandated to produce two reasonable sureties who are residents in Abuja and sign a register to be opened at the EFCC office every two weeks. Traki was brought to court on Thursday by the EFCC in compliance with an earlier order of the judge. During Traki's request for bail, the EFCC's lawyer, Mr. Mohamed Abubakar, who opposed the request, informed the court that the former governor was arrested at an event in Abuja on July 4, following an arrest warrant issued against the suspect about three years ago. The lawyer told the judge that the federal high court in Dutz, Jigawa State, had issued the arrest warrant after the Traki failed appear in court to face trial for charges filed against him about five years ago. Meanwhile, the EFCC has arraigned the administrative secretary of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, in Gomb State. Tarkumber Gregory alongside two retired staff before the state high court on allegations of bribery. According to the anti-graft agency, Administrative Secretary, Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Gomb State, Mr. Gregory Tarkumber, and two retired INEC staff, Bunyu Mulma and Yunusa Ali Biri were this morning arraigned by EFCC before Justice Abu Bakar Joro of High Court Nyingomb, over an 138 million bribe allegedly offered them by former Petroleum Minister, in the government of former President Goodluck Jonathan during the 2015 general elections. The defendants pleaded not guilty to all the charges leveled against them. The case was subsequently adjourned to November, 1 and 2 for hearing. The judge, Abu Bakar Jaro, also admitted the accused persons to bail on the terms of the administrative bail earlier granted them by the commission.